start off with some facts about the Atlantic sturgeon. The Atlantic sturgeon are one of the biggest fish found in the Hudson River. These fish have been around since the time of the dinosaurs. Unfortunately, these fish have faced some great challenges, such as drastic population declines in the 1900s from vessel strikes, overfishing, habitat loss and habitat degradation, and they were officially listed as endangered in 2012 under the Endangered Species Act. Atlantic sturgeon are endangered in the U.S., so there is no fishing for them here, but there is some important research and conservation going on right now. Some adaptations they have are bony scoots, which help to protect them, and sensory barbels, which help them to find food. These fish are anadromous, meaning they hatch in the freshwater part of the estuary, then migrate downriver to the salt water where they spend their adult lives. Biologists use a pop-up satellite tag to track the sturgeon as they migrate. Sturgeon that have been tagged in the freshwater Hudson River estuary in June by January have been found as far south as Georgia, as far north as the Bay of Fundy, or sometimes just off the Jersey Shore. Uh, my name is Amanda Higgs. I'm a fisheries biologist with the Hudson River Estuary Program. People should care about sturgeon because they're the largest fish in the Hudson River. They've been around since the time of the dinosaurs, and they're just an awesome fish. Now that you know a little bit about the Hudson River, there's many things we need to uncover. Remember, it's a river that flows both ways. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Please share for more info.